good? Yes, good. yes. You see? Yes. Good quality? Yes. All right. All right. Hey, y'all, how y'all doing? Missed y'all, you know. Thanks for the support and the keep asking me questions to do this and all that sort of thing. I really missed y'all. I miss doing this, you know. Uh, it's a passion of mine, you know. I do kind of like cooking, but I lost my passion, so I'm trying to find my way back slowly but surely. What we're going to do for y'all today is we're going to do some mac and cheese. We're going to do mac and cheese. So I used a 16 ounce box of elbow mac, which I've already cooked here. Just a little bit. I'm going to drain that water off. But yeah. I don't know who that is calling. We're not going to worry about who that's calling right now. Anyway, so 16 ounce box of mac and cheese. I'm going to go over here. We got, I want to say this is a 13 by 9 pan. Yes. And then also, we use small cheddar. Use the block cheddar and you grate it yourself. It's better to grate it yourself instead of getting that already shredded stuff because it has like cornstarch on it so it doesn't stick, which kind of changes the flavor. Plus, it gives it a freshness when you grate it yourself, in my opinion, anyway. So, that's freshly grated mild cheddar. Also, you can do any kind of cheese really with this. I mean, there's no kind of wrong way to do this other than some stove top box shit. That's the only way you can go wrong. But when you put a little effort into it, grate your cheese and stuff, you really can't go wrong. So, like I said, 16 ounce box, elbow mac. This was a 16 ounce block of mild cheese. Now, most of this cheese you're going to put in the mac, then you want to save some to coat on the top. But if you want the real cheese, you can put this whole thing in there and then just have some extra mild cheese. Or you can do sharp, or, you know, extra sharp, all different variations. And then just sprinkle that on the top and give it a nice coat. That's what you want to do. So, I'm going to try not to forget to use all this because this is the only cheese because we're on the budget. As you can see, we're in a new studio. Oops. Yeah, it's pretty small, you know. If you turn too hard, you get a damn concussion. But other than that, you know, we can cook, we can eat. You know, that's what we can do. So, I'm going to go ahead and drain this water off. You know, well, wash the hands, wash the hands. You didn't have to film me washing hands, but you know, you're, well, a little, you're a little too damn punctual, okay? You're a little too punctual. You don't have to do that much. You're making it a little too damn technical for what it really is. Do your thing, do your thing, do your thing. Thanks, Coach. Thanks, Coach. I feel I already had this shit drained down for y'all, but you know. Just. I'm slipping. Does it smell good in here? Does it smell like macaroni and cheese or something? I can't smell like that anymore, man. Me neither. Your, your, your stuff still messed up too? Yeah. Yeah, me too, bro. We're going to keep it working. We're going to keep it rolling. We better. Shoot. That's all we can do, you know. Shoot. <laughs> Make sure you drain all this excess water off real good. Also, you're going to need like a stick of butter and uh, three eggs, three large eggs. I'm not going to use my whole stick of butter because it's my last stick and I'm going to need some for bacon and eggs tomorrow for my kids. So. I gotta save some. <coughs> Definitely. You want to yeah. use roughly a stick. Ah. So, Dunny, you feel good coming back? Yeah. You happy? Your you get to, your fans get to see you put in that work. Yeah, I guess, you know, hopefully this comes out how I want it to, so, boom. So, like I said, first thing you want to put in is the butter. If you have it softened, it's probably better. So, like I said, I'm going to keep some of this. I need some, yeah, we're going to do about that much right there. <laughs> yeah, we got to use this one. Bacon and eggs, we gotta save. Yeah, we gotta yeah. save. I'm gonna use that little bit, spin the thing. And the rest of this, we're just gonna cut up in little chunks. That way it melts a little faster instead of one big block.
I already had you some dish water ready too. That way your kitchen prep and clean is easy. Easy, easy. So let me get a spoon. I was gonna use my spatula, but I don't wanna hear my cousin talk about it, so I just used the spoon. Take it, stir it through. Just stir it through to the butter melts all the way through. Look at the flick of the wrist. Uh, look at the flick of the wrist. Hey, yeah, you know about some flick of the wrist. See, that's what's wrong with the youth. That's why we're fucking doomed. You mean I'm just getting I'm just getting off what you said on your last video. You said look at the flick of the wrist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. sound good. Look at the flick of the wrist. Way to use me as a damn excuse for what not to be talking about. Fucking flick of the wrist. That it through pretty well now. A little bit chunks left. So keep stirring. Putting in that work, I think. All right, bet, man. You gotta keep spinning that way the butter is evenly coating all your noodles. Boom. Make sure you get from the bottom, side, the middle. Flip it, fold it, that sort of thing. You usually want to use one of those big spatula looking spoons, the big ones. But like I said, we're on the budget. We're starting over, so we ain't got all that. I was going to use the spatula, like I said. But hey, as you can see, it worked so well. Butter's evenly melted through, so you slowly add this cheese. Oh, yeah. You got excited, didn't you? You like cheese? No, yeah, dude. Good on macaroni. That's what, yeah. And it would be good with macaroni, You're right? That's you want to eat it without the cheese? That's what makes it macaroni and cheese, right? Yeah, that's what exactly. I'm All right, come on, mixing through, mixing through. Look at that. <clears throat> and like it's cool when your noodles is hot because you'll see the cheese melting, and then it'll look like if you've ever made Rice Krispie treats, how it look all stringy and just marshmallow everywhere. That's how your macaroni will look. Stirring, stirring. A little more cheese, but like I said, I gotta save to put some on the top. So I'm stirring, stirring. Stirring, stirring. There you go. As long as when you keep stirring and stirring, you see cheese all through it. It's coming in. There we go, Working men, working men. You gotta be patient. You can't just put it in there, stir it five times, and be like, okay, it's done, it's gonna be good. You gotta put some effort into this stuff. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, yes. Look at it. It's coming in delicious. There we go. Good mixed in. Alright, boom. Coming in pretty good. Oh, so. yeah. Alright. Yeah, that looks pretty good mixed. But also when it cool down like that too. And also, if you don't want to grate it, you can chunk it off and that way you have some chunks and stuff and it'd be nice and gooey when you dip out. That's a cool effect too. But I like for it to shred, that way it's evenly done. That's how my grandma and my mom made it. I think that's how granny made it. Never watched her do it, but it tasted the same. Alright, boom. Stir that enough. Should be good. Mixed all the way through. See the cheese melted all the way through. I get it close, man. Alright. Weak ass camera phone. We gotta get us a better budget. Our budget is just, you know, just through. No, boom. man. Alright, so now, they got some evaporated milk. And you want like three eggs for this size. Where the fuck did I put the oh the eggs right here? Haha. <laughs> Play them. Got him. Get you a little bowl. Get you a little bowl for dumping your eggs and stuff. Yeah. Oh, wrong one. Oh. Still got it. Still got it. Still got it. Uh uh, still got it. It was ugly, but it happened. It happened. Daddy, what 
Hey man, if you don't get your dinosaur looking ass out my kitchen, not the mama looking ass little boy. Anyway. Hey, man. Three eggs. See what you did, man. You gotta get off the camera film, dude. What's wrong with you? Can you? Three eggs. We're hating. Everybody wanna be on camera. Anyway. Hey, man. Chill. Alright, you put your three eggs. You wanna mix your eggs in milk together, then pour it in. It's the best way to do it. Okay, done. Secret. There's a difference between secret and favorite. Oh, I, 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 oh, I'm, I'm, I'm going to let you do your thing. And sometimes I wish you was my secret child instead of my favorite. I, I'm going to let you I'm gonna, I'm gonna let, I'm gonna let you do your thing. Do your thing. I ain't going to do your thing. Hopefully, the, hopefully this food tastes good, which it usually is. Cause You're going to say that because I'm your daddy. That's what you're supposed to say. You cooked it at my mom's house and yeah. Wait a minute. I don't even see you doing too much. You're doing too much. Hey, I'm sorry, Dunny, too. They're gonna, think we're, they're gonna think we're together, okay? Me and your mom is not together. Okay, okay, relax, You know dude. that, but the world don't know that. I can't relax, because you hating on me. Somebody might... Relax, dude, not, relax, dude. Yeah, it's just, it's yeah. just, it's just a, uh, I don't even know. Anyway. Relax. Anyway, you beat your eggs, you beat your eggs and milk with your seasoning in it together. You look good, Dunny. How does that look good like you just eat that? that, that you just well, I'm, not, I'm just you know saying the macaroni look good. Okay, whatever. The macaroni. You, you pour it in. You pour it all in. This motherfucker here, you just throwing me all off track. You pour it in there <laughs> and you mix it in. Mm. Mm. Make sure it's mixed in even and mixed through. That way everything is tested or been, you know, mixed together well, however you want to say it. I kind of fumbled over my words there, but I ain't perfect. I ain't getting paid for this yet. Everybody not perfect. Oh yeah, see how it's a little wet. See how it's wet, but it ain't swimming. See that? That's what you want. You don't want it all dry, and you don't want it swimming. You want it to like float. There we go. Didn't even through. Just put a little more cheese in there. I'm sorry. Yeah, cheese. It don't hurt. All right. Now I got it mixed. Go ahead and put it in the pan. Look coming good, honey. Oh, honey. Oh. Oh, that out. Take it out a little early because I about burnt that motherfucker. I ain't gonna lie, it about burnt. I was that close, but it really looks good. It looks really good. I 
can't smell it. It looked like it's, it smelled like it looked good. I don't know. It smelled like it looked good. They didn't make no damn sense. It smelled like it tasted good. Or it looked like it tasted good. I don't know, man. Damn medication, allergy medicine got me on this stuff. Hey, man. Right, hope you feel better. You are so gay, okay? I said I hope you feel better. I know, but you're such a cheerleader right now. I said I didn't need a cheerleader. I needed a camera what? person. And you're being real extra between you and your brother. That's why I about burnt the last motherfucking batch. Luckily, I, I made No, I wasn't even here. I wasn't even here. Man, whatever, dude. Ooh, because y'all... Oh, man, dude. We on film, man. I can't do this with you on film. Whatever. I can't do this with you at all, but I ain't got no choice. It's called child support and being a daddy, so whatever. I know my ass. What, baby? He said you can't see me. <laughs> <laughs> you can't see I'm doing something. This is such an unorthodox episode, but it's fine. It's my new reality, you know. Cooking, parenting, at the crib cooking. Oh, yeah. All right. Boom. So, after you do this, you get this. See? That, then that. Okay? All right. Appreciate y'all checking me out. This is your boy Danny signing out. Bye.